myself wondering what did happen to the last ten? So today I'm going to be trying to do all the cleaning of this house. I have so many things that I need to get out, like um, clean. Um, I have a pile of laundry to do. It's actually we've not been washing. We've not washed for more than a week now, and that's because the weather has been so discouraging, and we don't have a dryer. The people who have a dryer, it's just easy to just pop it in and put it in the dryer and that's it. But for us, we don't have a dryer, so we're still using the traditional um, way of drying clothes. So, because of that, I've been stalling washing because what's the purpose, what's the essence of washing your clothes when you can't dry them? So, it's, yeah. I'm basically going to be doing my cleaning, my bathroom needs cleaning, my kitchen needs cleaning, my every part of this house needs cleaning. So um that's basically one most important thing I want to do today, but we don't know. I don't know what my husband's plans are for today because it's not also working. But before they wake up, that's my husband and my son. I just want to kick start all the things I can do. So when I get tired, I'll take a break, make breakfast for us, and eat. And then after eating, if I can rest a bit, and then I'll continue. There's also this series I've been seeing on Netflix. It's a Nigerian series, Olola Day. I like the name, but I've been seeing reviews about it. Some people said it's not interesting. Some people said it's just trash, blah, blah, blah. Some people said they enjoyed watching it. It should have been mixed both positive and negative <laughs> reviews about the movie so i want to about the series sorry so i want to see if i can watch it today and again yeah, hmm, i have trainings from work that are almost due like they are almost out of date like the deadline is almost expiring i need to update my competency record i need to do my trainings today or tomorrow I'm off work today and tomorrow, so I want to see how to achieve all these things. And I still need to shop. I need to do grocery shopping either today or tomorrow. So I'm vlogging today and tomorrow anyway. So whatever I get to do, I'm, I'm praying that I'm able to do all these things. I just want to vlog it. You know, I like to vlog. For me, even though I enjoy people watching my vlog, I also see it as a way of documenting things that i i plan to do you know like setting out to do something and doing it i don't know for some people it might be like a norm but for me i see it as an achievement i see it as being productive so that's why i like to talk about this books so i hope you enjoy watching this vlog let's start if you're here for the first time thank you for stopping by i'm abimbola olani pekon I film about faithful family and lifestyle. If this type of content you like, please do well to stick around by subscribing to my channel. And please give me a huge thumbs up for this video. It helps, it goes a long way to help YouTube recommend my video to other people and make more people watch my content. And to all my returning subscribers, thank you so much for always stopping by. Thank you for always coming back to watch my content thank you for everyone that is always commenting you know engaging my videos and sharing i really appreciate you all i hope you enjoy watching this one again stay tuned
to pause to make breakfast because my son was already awake and he woke up very hungry. For breakfast, I decided to do this chicken this wrap um, or tortilla wrap because everybody in my family loves it. I love it. Iggy likes it as well. So since it's an option of breakfast that everybody likes, so I decided to go for the chicken wrap. <laughs> Moreover, I already had everything sorted out a night before so i already planned that this was what we we're going to have for breakfast so yeah was still asleep so i had to wrap his own in the foil to keep it warm till when he wakes up after doing about two batches of laundry and cooking breakfast and all of that I had to take a pause to have breakfast myself and as usual my son was also interested in what I had what I was going to have for breakfast and so we had to eat it together as well. After that I went on to the second task of the day which was to clean my toilet and bathroom area. Yeah, so that's just basically what I'm doing here. it was midday already and i had to you know beat aj and you know get him ready for the day after which i went for my grocery shopping even though i forgot to film anything about the shopping by the time i got back home from shopping it was late already like it was almost you know time for dinner so i proceeded to making dinner that day
what did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life, fast forward, never turn back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. Is this really happening? I can't be too sure. But one day I'll be yours again. Something from nothing I sit here looking for an answer Maybe the biggest question was in the last chapter You gave me the soul I have today Without you I never could have moved away But now I see what you teach I do believe I always should have stayed yeah. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true I'm just as surprised as you After making dinner, I proceeded to watching the series, which I really enjoyed. I don't know why people gave bad reviews about it, but me, oh, I enjoyed watching it. In fact, we slept late that night, like around 12 a.m. in the night, because we were watching this series and we watched to the end. The next morning, my husband brought me breakfast in bed, and then he even cleaned everywhere, cleaned the living room area, and the, everywhere the stairs everywhere was clean by the time I woke up. I later on snacked on this um, apple and peanut butter, which is now, <laughs> which of late has become like my snack, and then in the afternoon, I made amala. I already had sauce stew and everything in the fridge so i just brushed it out and made this amala for us to eat later on i decided to hang this um decorative um storage that i got from Shein. i decided to hang it as my tax of the day and then i unboxed this big carton of stuff that i got from Shein as well which has been lying fallow in my living room area waiting for me to unbox anyway that's all the things i got some of them thank are you so much for watching i hope to see you again next time bye